everyone, I'm Katrina and I am not a booktube newbie, so I've decided to do the not a booktube newbie tag. I'm actually really thrilled to be doing this tag because the new to booktube or booktube newbie tag created by Trina from Between Chapters wasn't around when I started out in the booktube community and I absolutely love the tag. It's such a great way to find out about new booktubers. I just search for the tag and scroll through all the recent uploads and find some great new people to subscribe to. I love it. I never got the chance to do it. So I'm very excited to do this variant of the tag because I've been here a little while just a little while. I have no idea if I was tagged by anybody, so if you did, thank you. If I wasn't tagged by anybody, then I'm doing it anyway, because that's how I roll. Okay, let's jump into the questions. How old is your channel? Five and a half years old, and if it were a human, it would already be starting school. What are your favorite videos to make? I really enjoy discussion videos about books and or reading. A couple of examples of these types of videos that I've enjoyed doing are talking about reading multiple books at once as well as reading slumps. I really enjoy those but they are quite time consuming so I haven't had the chance to do many of those recently just with all of the chaos that's been happening this past year but I really hope to do some more of those again. The other video that I really enjoy as well is unboxings just because I love unboxing mysterious packages so much so it's always really exciting seeing what's inside. What is one piece of advice that you would give to someone wanting to join booktube? Once you've started making videos, I would really suggest reaching out and connecting with other booktubers that are in a similar position with you. Whether this be they started making videos around the same time as you, they have a similar subscribe account, or even they really enjoy a lot of the same books that you do. Connecting with people that you have a common ground with can really help establish early friendships in your booktube career, and hopefully you will continue being friends throughout the entirety of your time in booktube. But they will also be there to support you and your channel and your content. So I find that it's so, so incredible valuable. So reach out to other people that you think you would get along with really well and establish those friendships. If you are wanting some more tips, especially on how to get started, I've done a couple of videos on this and I've also made a playlist where I've included a whole range of booktubers advice videos. So you can take a look through those, see if anything stands out to you that you can use. Since joining, have you run into any unforeseen challenges? I think one thing that's pretty relevant at the moment is that when I started, I didn't really imagine how little time I would have during certain periods of my life. I didn't really foresee that uni would be taking up so much of my time and I'd really struggle to maintain a consistent amount of videos that I'm posting. I think this is mainly because I took a gap year then I started back at uni only part-time so that I could ease myself back into study and then I worked my way up to full-time and I thought that I would have a better handle on my time management by that point but I really didn't. No. Mm -mm. What is a favourite book or series that you've read because of booktube? This is a tough one. I mean, most of the books that I've bought are probably due to another booktuber or someone from a different online book community. I'm probably going to go with The Name of the Wind by Patrick Rothfuss. I know that I discovered it via booktube, but I cannot for the life of me remember who first introduced me to the series. I have no idea. Overall, what is your favorite aspect of booktube? Since I've already talked about the people and making friends within the community, I'm gonna say something different. I think probably the fact that it's been such an enlightening and educational experience. I feel like I've learned so much through booktube and the online book community as a whole about books and reading and the publishing industry as a whole. There's just so much that I've learned because I've started making videos and made a lot of the connections that I have. I think that's probably another favourite, just the fact that I can rely on the online booktube community for a lot of information. Give at least one newbie a shout out. I have a couple of new booktubers that I want to recommend. The first is Tiffany from The Page Turner and specifically I want to recommend her recent video Why I Hate Mr. Perfect. So so I'll leave a link down below to her channel and the video that I mentioned. I would also like to recommend Penny from Penny and Books and also in particular her video where she explores Goodreads for the first time and takes you through creating her reading list. Both of those links are also in the description but I also wanted to ask you this question because I love finding new booktubers too so if there are any booktube newbies that you've recently discovered and you would love to recommend then feel free to leave a link to their channel in the comments so I can go check them out. Who do you tag? I'm not going to tag anyone specifically partly because I'm lazy but also partly because there's so many people that have been making this tag recently that I'll probably be re-tagging someone who's already done it so if you have not done this tag yourself and you are not a booktube newbie and you were interested in doing this tag then I tag you. If you are new to booktube and you haven't done the booktube newbie tag then I would recommend doing that one instead and then share that video with me in the comments below so I can check out your new channel. That was the booktube newbie tag I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you 
so much for watching. Until next time, I'll talk to you in the comments. Bye!